Flying is one of the oldest dreams of mankind. To be able to reach every destination and only follow the unlimited horizon. Safety is an indispensable matter of course. As a CEO of a business airline, I feel responsible and I'm directly liable for the daily safe operation. And as a pilot, I'm responsible for the safety of the crew and the passengers on board and for the safety of the airplane as well. In a business aviation, we have learned that an open communication within the company is a key fact and helps to improve the safety culture in the company. We have to give the employees a chance to report thoughts and mistakes without any personal consequences. For my understanding, quality and success is a result of a better safety culture in the company. Safety is vital for every company in order to perform successfully on a long-term basis. Excellence in process safety performance has to be based on a positive corporate safety culture. Therefore, not only technical excellence is required, but also a positive, trusting and open environment, with effective lines of communication between management and the workforce, including employee representatives. In order to support and sustain a high level of process safety performance, management must periodically evaluate the management system, the safety culture and the corporate safety oversight and address any identified deficiencies or opportunities for improvement. The organization's desire for excellent process safety performance has to be translated into processes and procedures that can be managed. Only the implementation of such an integrated, comprehensive and effective process safety system ensures process safety excellence. To emphasize process safety, it's important to establish process safety as a core value across all levels of your company. The process safety management system requires significant involvement by an organization's leaders. The company's leaders must establish performance objectives, develop and implement a system to accomplish them, provide the necessary resources and then foster a culture in which the system can operate as intended. Process safety uh, is a prerequisite for our license to operate. Society expects us to master our processes. If one incident happens, uh, within the chemical industry, it has, of course, negative repercussions to the whole industry. One incident spoils the image of the chemical industry. For an excellent process management in a company, this, the senior management and the top management have to visibly and uh, credibly show their commitment and their safety consciousness. Excellence in safety management uh, contributes directly to, to economic uh, benefits. It helps produce the right product in the right spec in the right time. Improving process safety management uh, comes at a cost, but it pays mid-term and, and long-term. And by that, they protect their employees, they motivate their employees, they protect their assets, and they maintain the license to operate. Process safety hazards can give rise to major accidents, which can have catastrophic effects and may result in multiple injuries and fatalities, as well as substantial economic, property and environmental damage. Continuously reducing process risks will help reduce the economic or opportunity costs associated with a site operating at less than full capacity or not operating at all. Other potential benefits of investment in operations and process safety, such as reliability, customer relations and corporate image, as well as improved workforce morale and increased productivity, may be difficult to measure, but are equally important. In order to achieve these benefits, it is necessary that corporate officials exercise appropriate leadership to promote compliance with safety management systems that process safety is effectively incorporated into management decision-making at all levels, that employees are empowered to promote improved process safety, and that process safety programs receive adequate resources and take into account the cost-benefit ratio of measures to achieve best results. I 
think financial markets are very much aware of safety risks and of their consequences and therefore would, would definitely pressurize uh, managements uh, where they have the impression that they don't care. Clearly, there is a connection between the overall performance of a company and their safety record. If, if they have a bad safety record, uh, they are done, and they are done for a long while. And uh, I think it also says quite a lot about the quality of management, whether they care, whether they are concerned about it, whether they are prepared to uh, invest in prevention uh, of operational risks. Whereas uh, if a top management can convey the message uh, to the market that uh, they are concerned with safety, that this is a permanent duty to take care of safety, it's a permanent duty to invest in safety, which then satisfies investors, satisfies uh, clients, and satisfies people who are working in the company. It's an ongoing task, it's not a thing which you do and then you have invested and then everything is fine, it's not. If process safety is embedded in all aspects of corporate culture, management systems and operations, your business will benefit in many ways on a long-term basis. With personal responsibility and a professional process safety management, you will certainly achieve your targets.